photographing some uh, Dreams bottles for Client Alpha Designs. So I just wanted to bring you through my lighting setup. Now you would think because these bottles are just water bottles and they're quite a sort of easy product to look at and pretty simple. Um, you're wrong. <laughs> set so I want one, two, three, four lights in total set up for these product shots um, so the reason being is that the colours so I'll just grab one here for you um, so we've got these in um, five different five different colours I think it is um, so yeah five different colours and um, some are lighter in colour some are darker in colour um, it's important that we show off what is the handle and also show off the logo here and potentially show off how many litres are in there as well. Um, so the trick here is to uh, backlight the product. So my initial thoughts were if I backlight it from my experience of backlighting stained glass, um, that would work. Um, that wasn't quite enough. Um, so I did the first light uh, back here. So the first light was this one. I had it slightly further back here from a low angle to shoot right through the product. That wasn't enough. Um, so then what I did is I put this light in here with a nice Octobox, with nice soft light, a uh, very natural light. That wasn't enough again. So the third light that I actually added was uh, this light here, which actually is lighting the black background. So it gives us a black background that's slightly grey colour. Um, and lastly, I added the one over here, which as you can see is coming onto those products on the bench there. And so when I put my hand over that, you can see it's not shining through. So it's just picking up a bit of that detail, making sure the shade of the product is shown, um, making sure picking up this logo here, and making sure the colour really pops on the black background. Um, so that's kind of the lighting setup, um, and I'll run you through um, the shots on the computer. So this is the final product shot, and if you go back to the very first image here, you can see it was very, very dark, barely even visible. Um, and then we built that up over the time, added the lights in, and as you can see, you have to build a shot. It's not just about um, just one light on; it'll do. We have to build it. So. Bit by bit, you can see we added the different lights in there. I had to pull back also because my crop was too zoomed in for a square crop for Instagram. So I just pulled the camera back. Um, I tried turning the bottles as well to show a little bit more on the handle of the jug. And also just to see if we could get that logo a little bit better. Um, it, it sort of worked, it got the shape where you can get the logo. Um, so then at that time I added that uh, back light from the left hand side and we ended up with the final shot there. So also turning the lights up in power to give it more light and more oomph behind the picture. So in terms of products uh, and the props, we also chose a gin bench which is a standard um, prop at the Picture Perfect Studio. I've also got to the side there for future shots. I've got uh, weight plates, bars, slam balls, things like that. Things that you find in your gym, basically. So that's my sort of basic lighting setup, if you can call it basic, for these water bottles today. 